I've always lived in the Willamette Valley my whole life. I grew up in Eugene, and um, I live in the uh, Alberta Arts District. I like being near the mountains and the not too far from the coast, and um, yeah, it's a beautiful place to live. I try to work faster than I can think so that forms come, you know, in a more intuitive way. I feel that I can do that better with wood than I can with anything else. I am working on my third book, Alpha Bird, which is an alphabet book that features uh, all wood birds that I've made. For every letter of the alphabet, there'll be a bird whose species starts with that letter and a musical instrument that starts with that letter as well. Well, I grew up in a family who appreciated handmade and craft, and so it's always been part of my life. To me, handmade is really personal. It's, it's, it's about not only an object, but a, um, the person behind that object who made it. I think the recent resurgence in uh, handmade and craft has everything to do with the internet. People can share information a lot more readily than they could, you know, 30 years ago, let's say. Now it's great. You can look up anything on the web and see a video of somebody making a traditional basket or weaving. That's the loveliest thing about it. 